It's extraordinary, isn't it, that the one person who didn't seem able to do her job when she was an MP, or when she was a minister, simply cannot keep quiet. In the final days of Boris's parliament, she was all over the news, looking weepy and incoherent. Now she seems to have found her voice. She's very coherent. And she's using Twitter. For a while, her Twitter feed disappeared. One wonders why that happened. And now she's saying things like, so, so today, she's come out with this line, MPs circulating a smorgasbord of names, Ray, who should replace Truss as PM, are not taking into account the fact that they cannot foist upon the British public another Prime Minister that the public have not voted for. A totally untenable position. Uh, hashtag back Liz. And this is presumably after, this is presumably some sort of U-turn that she's done after having, uh, you know, sort of slammed Liz Truss herself anyway. So I don't quite understand where Nadine Doris is coming from. I think the thing about Nadine Doris is she just wants to keep her mouth opening and closing. Well, actually opening. She just wants a permanent babble to be pouring out, like 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 one of those. Um, do you remember the elephants in um, Fantasia? Those wonderful elephants that just sort of snorted bubbles. Well, that's that's really Nadine Doris, isn't it? Sort of continual. Oh my goodness, <laughs> the cat is moving. A continual, um, a, a continual snort of bubbles. There we are, Nadine.